welcome back to the stream. So glad you're here with us this morning, especially because we are starting a new segment to show off the best Chicago area schools have to offer. We're so pumped about this new franchise. Our Ryan Baker kicking us off with a school spotlight at Homewood Flossmore High School. Good morning, Ryan. This is so cool that you get to be the one out there kicking us off with this uh, new school spotlight. It is so exciting, Audrina, and we're so thrilled to be here at Homewood Flossmoor High School, or HF as it's known in these parts in the south suburbs. And right now we're in the Performing Arts Center, and I got to tell you, there is some amazing talent here at Homewood Flossmoor High School. Take a look at this original artwork that students have painted and sculpted together. We're going to show you some of this stuff that's on display here uh, in the lobby of the Performing Arts Center. And speaking of talent and our amazing future and what the, the, the wonderful uh, students at Homewood Flossmoor is producing. We have Ahmad Powell, a junior here. Good morning, Ahmad. Good morning. Uh, you are just highly regarded out here. Everyone's singing your praises, so we're just honored to have you with us here on this school spotlight. Uh, tell us about your experience at HF and how it's preparing you for your future. You're telling me computer science is, is what interests you. Yeah. Um, I think HF is preparing me well. Everyone here, the faculty, the staff, the students, all bring a different kind of energy. We're all here trying to get better, and I love that, and it's making me better as a person. So they're creating the environment for you to excel. Of course. And, and what are some of your favorite things about HF? Favorite things? I mean, just the staff. You can see it in how they act with the students and how they treat them. So they care. Yeah, they care so much, and it helps me pay attention as a student, and it helps my classmates do the same thing. Well, thanks so much for being with us. Wish you all the best. And like you're repping that HF there, yeah. the Vikings. And uh, so, Adrena, I know all about a dad bod, but they got the dad squad here at uh, Homewood Flossmoor High School. And these wonderful men have joined us this morning. This is the dad squad. You give yourselves a big hand. You look so great this morning. <laughs> thanks for being with us on CBS Chicago on the stream this morning. So first of all, tell us what the dad squad is, how it started and what you guys try to accomplish. Well, it's, a, it's a, a group of men that come together um, uh, that was founded by uh, the Parent Teacher Association that they really want to have a present at all the different school functions from games to just passing by in the hallway. So, and it's, it's, it's really a good look for the children. Uh, they like seeing us and it, it exudes strength and, and power. So, And you guys love volunteering your time to help um, these young people. Most definitely, yes, sir. You know, and sometimes dads get a bad rap that, you know, we're not involved and don't care. You guys are up early here volunteering your time. And, and tell me, are you guys part of the organizers for the Dad Squad? I am the president for the Homewood Flossmoor Parent Association. And these are our executive committee members. Okay. And I recognize this guy. This is my old U of I classmate, uh, you know, out here on the Dad Squad. And uh, as, as a mentor, how fulfilling is it for you to be a part of this Oh, it's phenomenal because we see the kids in the community, but when we also see them in a school setting, they also see that we're part of the fabric, trying to hold the school up and try to bring everything together and also interact with Dr. Wakely and Dr. Alexander to really try to reinforce what they're doing on a daily basis, working with the exec committee and also the other parents here as well. You heard of mine talking about the great faculty and the support from the staff, but it does take a village, doesn't it? It totally takes a village. And, and part of the, the dad squad is representing our community as well as the high school. And that's our overall objective. We have the principal over here. Good morning, doctor. How are you? How you doing, sir? Yeah. Uh, how important is this dad squad? You know what? It's a, a great symbol of strength and support and community engagement. Uh, when we met, it was like three of us, and we talked about a vision. And how do we get our parents involved, particularly our dads? And we came up with dad squad. So first the name came and rung a bell, and then we thought maybe 30 would show up, but 40 showed up, more 50 showed up the first year. So the interest was there? Yeah, the interest was there. And then our second annual dad squad, we had about 90 dads. So it was phenomenal. That is I couldn't have asked for anything better. Amazing. Dr. Alexander, the yes. principal here at Homewood Flossmoor High School, congratulations and, and well done to the dad squad. I got to be an honorary member, even though I got to come back <laughs> here to age. We had to, I'll, I'll gladly, I'll, I'll rep the dad squad. Audrina, great things going on here at Homewood Flossmoor High School. We will be here throughout the morning here on the stream and again on our 9 a.m. newscast and another crew coming this afternoon as we get this school spotlight going at Homewood Flossmoor High School. Back to you. Oh, Ryan, I love to see the dads showing up. They had a call for for dads, dozens. Isn't it amazing? Up. It is so amazing. So great to see that. We we'll love that. Kudos to the dads out there. Thanks, Ryan. Well done. Well done. Yeah. Yes. Thank Absolutely. You.